Namaste guys. This is a walk and talk. You don't need to see me. I look horrible. Look at that beautiful. Look at that. That's beautiful. The angels. That's really pretty. Anyway. How's everybody doing? I'm not doing so good. I need your help. Ever since yesterday, I've been having a floater in my eye. Or I, at first I thought it was a fly that was flying by, a black fly. Then I realized, and then I saw white. Um, so I thought, of course, I thought it was orbs. I thought I was being, um, you know, psychically attacked. Uh, I never worry if it's white, but this was like, I felt like somebody was touching me. And I would look up, and it was, I, I felt like I had a string on me. And I would look up, and there was no string. But in my eye, in my left eye, um, even right now, it's like four, like, little black half circles. And sometimes they move, and sometimes they don't. Like, right now, they're not moving. Did anybody ever have that? So... The reason why I'm walking is because Devin said, maybe take a walk, see if you feel better. I called up the ER and I asked them because I didn't want, I wanted to make sure I didn't have a detached retina. <sighs> oh, so crazy. Um, but he was telling me it sounds like a cluster migraine. And uh, he goes, do you have a history of migraines? I said, yeah, I actually do. My doctor knows about him. He goes, did he ever try to give you medicine? I said, yeah, but it cost $999, so I rejected it. <laughs> anyway, I'm really... Then I have Devin take my uh, sugar because I have been feeling dizzy lately, and um, we were trying to pack Christmas presents and I turned around and I got dizzy. He caught me. But that's probably because there was 700 boxes in the room. And I tripped over the boxes. Anyway, when he took my sugar. Now I'm used to that. My sugar has always been good. Even though, you know, I don't eat great. <laughs> but I specifically did not have any, like, candy or potato chips. I had... A Rice Krispie Treat, which that's not great, but there really wasn't much breakfast. I had a Rice Krispie Treat, and I had two cups of coffee, and a, um, ooh, ooh, guys, I gotta run. One second. Sorry, I told you I look bad. This is the eye that's real bad. I've been crying, of course. <laughs> I've been crying. Because I can't, I, I can't live this way. Right now, it's right when I look down, sort of. It's right down there. And then a whole bunch of them are floating. I gotta go home. <laughs> it's cold. You know when you know when um you have a fire and you're burning something on a fire and a whole bunch of little pieces break off from the fire and fly into the into the air. That's what I see. <laughs> That's what I see.
right, so uh, my sugar was 167, and uh, I don't remember it ever being that high. So 167 is ridiculous, and I don't understand it. And like two days in a row, I didn't have dinner. Just had like breakfast and lunch, or like a lunch. And maybe that's the problem, because this girl needs three meals a day in order to not feel dizzy anyway. I'm going to probably cut it short because I don't feel well. Now, the spots went away a little bit. I'm like anticipating when they're going to come back. And then this eye is not doing too good either because it's blurry. My right eye doesn't have the floaters or anything in front of it. But it's blurry. I kind of go like this. It's just blurry. I took my vitamins. Um, I heard B12 is supposed to be really good for your sugar uh, and headaches. Um, I have to look for my B12, but my vitamins, uh, Balance of Nature, includes that. So, but anyway, maybe I've been just doing too many cases. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Sorry for being a buzzkill. I'm going to show you something really pretty in two, three, one. Isn't that pretty? You shouldn't be looking at me, ugly me. You should be looking at this beautiful scene. Beautiful trees. That beautiful swing. That Those two chairs are nice. Isn't that pretty? The reason why I have a cane is because Devin is afraid of dogs or, or animals, somebody attacking me when I walk, when it's a little bit dark out. But it's really, it's not dark yet. It's not too dark for me. So, oh, guys, I didn't forget. I got to do Sagi Wadgies. When I feel a little bit better, I'll do the Sagi Wadgie reading because I enjoy that. I enjoy that. That's not like the murder reading. And also, um, the 7th is today the 7th or tomorrow? Tomorrow's the 7th? Yeah, tomorrow. Um, but you could put out your moon water tonight and do affirmations. Just take a, a glass jug. You take a glass jug. It has to be glass. It doesn't work in plastic. And I put a sticker on mine that says, like, things that I want to happen. And you fill it up with, with like, filtered water. Could be bottled water. Could be any kind of filtered water. And you put it in the moon. And let the moonlight hit it. But you got to bring it in before the sun comes up. And I didn't know that. But it really does make a difference. So get your moon. I remember these slates. I used to always do this walk. Yeah, so I constantly feel dizzy. Um, but I always think it has to do with my neck angle. You know, when I get adjusted, I feel better. Maybe I'll do the occipital pillow that I have. Just lay on that for a couple minutes. Because all I've been doing is researching, reading, channeling. Um, haven't been doing anything fun. I mean, channeling uh, is it, it takes a lot of your brain. Um, so last night I was resting after I came home from the nail shop. Yay! I finally got a a good girl. I went back to my old nail shop that I used to go to. Um, I have 
I don't have fights with people. I just, if they do something that is, they don't listen to me and it comes out bad, I always tip them. But then I say, I'm not going to go back to you again. <laughs> and then I have to find it's on to the next place. Um, so pretty much I've been here almost eight years and I've been to so many nail shops. I, I now I'm going back because I'm running out of nail shops. Yeah, that's possible. Not New York though, but it's possible here. Um, yeah, so I feel a little bit better. Uh, I still see specks of the black things. I don't know if it has to do with my blood pressure. I don't know what it has to do with, but I don't want to live with this thing in my eye. So I took two Excedrins thinking maybe that'll do it because if he said it was a migraine that didn't have pain, well, maybe I just have a high tolerance for pain dealing with my back and my neck without drugs. Um, all these years, look at this Santa. Oh, something beautiful and happy. Two, three, one. Hi, Santa. And look at that. This is the chicken. The chicken. He's all decorated for Christmas. Hi, chicken. Hi, chickity chick. Hi, snowman. Hi, Santa. Yeah, we got a couple things up, but of course, never done, never done. I like to do Christmas decorations December 17th, but Devin is going to be taking his brother to Houston for his cancer treatments, his cancer checkup, um, and to fix his... Um, palate in his mouth that cracked months ago. Finally, his doctor is back, and usually he goes with one of his students or somebody else, his friend, uh, but he might not have anybody else to take him. So, Devin has to drive him, and then they have to sleep over in Houston. Um, it's a big trip, and I worry about Devin, too, because that's a long drive for him and his he's got neuropathy so he, he can't feel his feet but he always has to drive because his brother his brother really can't see too well or whatever so he's like we got to put the Christmas decorations up sooner so so far we have the tree up and we organize some of the presents that have to go in the mail um, so that's the start. That's the start. But then I just stopped everything because of my eye. You know, and I have to take time out to cry. Because I'm a big baby. You know that. You guys know that. So I am so sorry that I look horrendous. That's why. I can't even go to the... I can't even go to the ER until I take a shower because I just, I can't go like looking like this. Yes, I am vain. I'm not narcissistic in that. If I was really narcissistic, I wouldn't show you myself without makeup on and my hair is terrible. Um, I would have put on a wig, put my makeup on, but I can't put any makeup on my eyes because... And I really, I want to work tomorrow. I miss out on two jobs today because I'm an idiot. I called up last night. I called up at 8.30, at 9.30, at 10.30, 11.30, 12 o'clock. And then I think even 1 o'clock. But all the jobs were far away and I can't, it wasn't schools that I do. So I didn't take them. So. I was just up to my usual, I don't know, 
I fell asleep with the dog on the couch last night, which was nice. Sometimes when I get nervous, all I do is I take him out of his cage. So he picks up on my feelings. And I was having the thing in my eye. I was freaked out because I thought I was just being psychically attacked. And I thought it was like things go flying around touching me. And flashes, like it's like flashes in your face. And then when I realized it wasn't a bug and it wasn't psychic attack, because I wasn't doing any readings yesterday. Um, when I realized it wasn't that, then I was like, oh my God, it's even worse because it's not something I can really fix. So I get all nervous. And then I wanted to be up on board available at 6 a.m. just in case the school does call me. And what happened was I, I must have fell asleep with my phone or I, I must have fell asleep without my phone. And I got two phone calls. One was at 6 a.m., which I could have done it if I, you know, I, what I do is I tell Devin, set the clock for six. No matter what, um, I'll get up. I'll see if there's any calls. If not, go back to bed. But uh, I just didn't happen. It didn't happen because at one o'clock in the morning, I called, I did my last call and there was not any jobs that I would go to. There was two like really far away schools that I, I just don't go to. It's a waste of gas. Um, I'm down to like a good four or five schools that I, I would do. Anyhow, two schools called me and then I called them back and they were like, that's all right, we got this. In other words, F you. <laughs> Not F you, but you weren't there for us. One of them said, do you even work anymore? Do you sub anymore? I was like so embarrassed. I said, yes, I do. Um, I said, how about tomorrow? How about the next day? How about the rest of the week? And both of them said, oh, um, that's okay. We got this. And then one of them was the principal called me back a little bit later in the morning, I guess at 10 and said, um, we don't have anything for this week, but how about next week, um, Monday through Thursday? I was like, that's a good gig. But it might not be as a regular teacher. So, but that's okay. I take it anyway. Because she, I said, what would it be for? And she said, you'll fill in for a lot of teachers that are doing testing. And I said, okay. Thank you so much. So I'm definitely working next week, four days. But I would like to get some days in. Even if I do have a retina problem. Hi. Bye. So, that was the story. Um, yeah. Oh, I guess, I guess what I'm trying to say is, even if you feel like you're sick, even if you feel like there's no hope in sight, you can't see any one of your eyes, Go for a walk. So I've been walking for 18 minutes. No, I've been walking longer than that. Um, I made a couple of calls first before I came on the air. But anyway, I feel a little bit better. But like I said, maybe if I take a shower after I'm finished walking, maybe I'll feel better because that's what's missing. I'm not walking enough or at all. Um, yeah, what happened to the gym? Uh, if I could at least just walk, it'll be fine. You know, walk for a half hour, uh, 20 minutes. But the doctor said half hour, five days a week. Have I been doing that? No, I started out doing it. Then you fall off the wagon and then you got to get back up on the wagon again. And the weird thing about it is, two nights in a row, 
For two nights in a row, I haven't been having any drinks, right? No Jesus juice. Trying to be good. And just have chamomile tea. And yeah, it's, that's that. Oh, crap. Just reminded myself, we got to go pick up my medicine. Oh, crap. Yeah. I don't have any medicine left. I gotta go pick up my medicine. Anyway. So, what I was gonna say is, um, I forgot what I was saying. I forgot. I straight up forgot what I was saying. I'm gonna show you a weird roof. Tell me if you think it's weird. I guess it's like a solar roof. Oh, I better hurry. I better hurry. A car is coming. See that? It's a solar roof, I guess, right? I guess it keeps the house hot. I mean, keep, yeah, hot when it's cold out and cool when it's hot out. Not sure how that works. Uh, yeah, I forgot. I have. I ran out of my level throxin, and I think I skipped that today. Didn't take it today. My level throxin, my ambium, and muscle relaxants. I'm out of all of it. So. I bet I, I should just be turning home right now and going home. But I'm trying to make it a solid walk of 30 minutes. So that's why I'm on here. Um, yeah, I haven't heard anything. Oh, God. It's like the specks of black again all over. Like when you're having the fire, I know I said this already, I'm repeating myself. There's black dot there, black dot there, black dot over there. And all this time I thought I was burning things and starting fires, but meanwhile it's just something wrong with my eye. Anyway. I'll have to look up affirmations for the eyes. So, I don't know what I was saying was, so for two days, I, I know I wanted to do a really good reading for the, for the kids, uh, Idaho 4, for Maddie, Kaylee, Ethan, and Zana, and um, so I didn't have my Jesus juice, I didn't take my medicine, I was still willing to go to work, that was Sunday night, um, but you know what? I felt like duty called and I want I needed to get that out um, because I had done two other videos about them but I wanted to really concentrate to see if I could find who the killer was and I have I have it narrowed down to two people two guys um, but I feel it was one killer it's just that I think of two guys two different guys okay anyhow I don't like to say names because I don't want to ruin anybody's life. Because um, I could be wrong. Not God. But anyhow, so I didn't have my Jesus juice yesterday. I didn't have my Jesus juice the day before. And I don't see how it... I don't see how that helps me. I feel like I'm calm when I want to have my Jesus juice. Anyway. So... If anybody has any ideas on what the heck might be wrong with me, with this dude over here, let me know. I'd love to know. Okay? John Owen's house could be. Look at this big, beautiful tree. Isn't that beautiful? Trees make me happy. The other day when I was in school, last week when I was in school doing the Wednesday and the Thursday gig, 
um, in my favorite school, my favorite classes. And it came to Thursday when I was giving away the prizes. And there wasn't much left because always one class takes more than the other class. And then there's just slim pickings left for the second class. But they were like, we can have this? And I was like, yeah, that's right. And they were like, Miss Brady, why do you, why do you bring us presents? Why do you let us have prizes, so many prizes? And I said, because I love you and you deserve it. And then they just were like, ah. it was such a, it was like a, the best drug in the world which was seeing these kids just happy with simple things. It was a, One of them was an old book. It was like 1950-something. I should have kept it for myself, but I was like, what am I going to do with it? Let me just get it off my floor. It's been in the living room floor, a box of books. Let me get it into my car, give it out as prizes. And they just seemed so happy with like, you know, one one thing I gave away was, um, which was really cool, which was these leaves, and it came with this stick, and you scrape it, and all different colors come out. Like it's like a black, red, green, orange, and you scrape it, or you can write your name. I told them, you have to put it in your, you have to put it in your, book bag and they were like what's a book bag they call it a backpack I call it a book bag okay and don't take it out because if you take it out I'm just going to take it away from you and there's no trading you could trade at home but you can't trade with anybody because the other teachers were getting kind of mad because the kids were like playing with their, all the things that I was giving them for free so remember I had a whole classroom that I set up, I had to dismantle, and I can't keep any of the stuff. My house is crowded enough. So I gave away all these plastic containers. I kept one thing for myself, because I have a lot of crap in it. But anyway, I gave away artwork. One painting that I, Native American painting I brought to that school, I, it was stolen from me, I never got it back. Anyhow. What are you going to do? That's all in the past now. What's meant to be will happen. What's, what's karmic to happen, what's your life contract, will happen. Okay, sorry to be so stoic and mystic, but I am mystic already. After all, I am so sorry I look a hot wreck. That's why I like to go to work. Because then I'll be all showered, I'll have my makeup on. I'll just have to be careful with the makeup because I think it was the glitter. I had this glitter makeup on yesterday. And I think it got in my eye. But the guy seemed to think it was a complex. Ew. He pooped right over there. He's probably mad at me. I'm not pooped over there. Anyway, it was 28 minutes so I could just walk back and forth right here. Let me just get my dog out. Yeah. Oh, can I take him out for a second? Because I just have three more minutes on my walk. Um, I'll tell you, I'm seeing a lot more black things. You got wool? You got wool? Good boy. Good boy, you got it? Casper one. Casper one. Casper one. Hi guys. Hi guys. <laughs> You're still my favorite. You're my favorite baby. You're my favorite baby boy. Are you my favorite baby boy? 
And I do, guys, I do like, I try to do 40 of these where you bring your leg up. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. See, in 40 seconds, you can get 40 leg lifts in. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay. That's 30 minutes on the on the thing, but I was walking probably five or six minutes before I, I went on. So I did about 60 leg lifts. Now am I a good person? Now am I acceptable into society? Oh, I don't think so. Right here, I still see the, oh. And I look up, I see the string up here. It's like a black string. All right, guys, pray for me. Pray for your mystic Brady, okay? Prayers do work. Love you guys. Namaste. Actually, I'm going to go look up some eye affirmations. And then go in the shower. If I don't feel good after that, I'm going to ER. See this cane that Devin gave me to use? It's a zebra. Isn't that cute? It's a freaking zebra. <laughs> hey babe. <laughs>